Hello everyone, how are you all? Hope you're all well. I finally got the VIC-20 up and running. I've got a penultimate plus cartridge in. I've got the um, SD to IEC plugged in as well, which means I've got loads of games on here. But I'm going to look at one game today and we'll go further into the library another day. But uh, the penultimate plus cartridge here has all the future is 8-bit games, uh, normal games, adventure games, paddle games, utilities all the different ways to actually um, put your different ROM cartridges because some games that you load from tape have, need different size cartridges as well as you can just go straight to your SD to IC. But today we are going to be playing uh, a game, one of my favourite games on here and honestly if this game had come back out during, in the day would have completely blown everyone out of the water, it really would. But we're going to play some Cheese and Onion and it's a homebrew platform game for the VIC-20 and yeah, it said it's one of my favourite games. Got some good music with it. Uh, we'll have to quickly go for the menus because um, the background's there. See how the background's scrolling? You can switch it off so it's static. I prefer it static. It just hurts my eyes otherwise. And uh, you've got high scores, easy peasy, speed runner, or adventure. We're going to go for the adventure mode. And yeah, so really fun little platform with this. If you've never heard of it before, um, please give it a go. Even if you don't have a VIC-20, try and emulate it because this is just amazing. It's got like, got the scrolling as well, which, you know, it's a VIC-20. Just remember that, VIC-20. This came out in, um, was it 1980? Please correct me if I'm wrong. I, th I think it's 1980. It might be 1981. I'm sure somebody will let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, let me know as well. Did you have a VIC-20 back in the day? Because... Loads of people who I speak to, it's either it's Commodore, it's, it's Spectrum, it's everything else, but it's normally Commodore 64. So, was the VIC-20 your first computer? And if it was, what games did you play on it? Uh, my first game that I ever played after picking this up, I got this VIC-20 um, actually from a charity shop, a mate of mine found it. Um, and it had no games, I got a Mega Race. So, a Mega Race is my first VIC-20 game. Um, it doesn't look anything like this. I mean, come on, look at the scrolling. That is the bit that impresses me the most. Gotta jump over this guy. The whole object of the game is you've got to go around the screens and pick up the coin. Oh, oh I barely touched ya. Oh, I've got to do that again now. You've got to go around the screens and you've got to pick up all the coins or whatever they are, the collectible things. Uh, to advance to the next level. That's why I said you got the speed run mode. So it has got re. Oh, damp, damp, damp. <laughs> I, I jumped without looking. You can just see the top of his. Um, his it's Christmas, let's say antlers. Um, just peering at the top there. These here as well, you get two hits on them. And they do that. Uh, I meant to do that. I was genuinely showing you how they work. <laughs> if you believe that, you'll believe anything. Um, we have we go. Uh, those spikes as well can be a bit of a pain. And we're just going to jump over him properly this time. Up this ladder. Uh, you do have to be quite precise with the jumps, but um, it's it's very fair. Yeah, it kind of pixel perfect, but yeah, not 100%. You get what I mean? There's a little bit of leeway. But you can get closer to the edge of platforms than you think you can. Oh, be careful jumping up here. You see how I'm jumping fully there? If you were higher up like on that platform I was just before there, you can bounce your head off the ceiling. So there are some jumps later on that you've got to really be careful with. See what I mean about here? Look, look you hit your head. Oh, no, not there. <laughs> trying to explain something doesn't happen. Eee. Now, if you can see, when I was saying about you can just about see the antlers, see it just there, look, just peering down. And then I've got to go this way. And that should be the level. We can quickly play through the second level as well. Um, well, we're five minutes in. Yeah, that's all right. We got time. We got time. Um, but this is just more of a just a, a first impressions of the game. I have got um, someone let me know whether you can get rid of like, the the bars on the screen because I've just got a scarf for the Vic Twenty, and mine is really quite an early model. Um, I just wondered, can anything be done about that to clear up the picture even more? 
Yeah, see, like the hidden level then, where you have to like do a secret little jump. Uh, kind of like a leap of faith. This one actually took me a while to figure this out. You skid on that one. Um, so I was here for, for a little while and realised that, well, how'd you get out? Well, Mario, think Mario. Down the pipes. <laughs> so, yeah, that's that's how you do that. I can't remember if there's any more hidden ones. I'm sure as we go along, we'll we'll figure it out. You've got to press uh, jump on the ladders. You can go up, but you can't go down. Oh, there's got to be a reason why he's there. It's always a reason. Just it's just fun. You oh oh I got if I got glitched. Oh no, just went through the wall. Um got a bit of wall jumping here as well, gotta do. So that they're mixing all different uh different skills that you need in, especially for the later levels. Oh, this one here. We've said about these things take two hits. You really need to be careful with them because if you jump on all of those, you can't get back from this screen. These ones speed you up. Whee, off we go. And leap of faith. Oh, through the middle. <laughs> Hell, do you know what? I could, if I tried, I couldn't do that. I could normally hit at least one of them. Oh, let's try again anyway. Let's try again. There we are. Hit it that time. <laughs> all jump, all jump. No, jump, jump. <laughs> These spikes can be a bit annoying as well. You've got to really be like on them like that. Ah, oh, not on them like that. <laughs> it's ultimate continues as well in this, so there's no reason to stop playing. Um, you just get better at it as you go or completely fail like that. There we are, we're over. Oh, balls. <laughs> Gotta do it again, because I need to be up there. Right, there. That'd have to be quite pixel perfect on that one. And these are disappearing platforms, so you've got to time it right. Yes. Oh, I always hold my breath doing that. And then we've got some more of these. Now this guy will chase you and then jump over. Oh, got to wait for him to go back now. I fell down here. Yes. That was close. And up the ladder. Because I'm sure there's one more. Well, there is one more, because otherwise I would have been done by now. Oh, leap of faith again. Took an extra hit there. Oh, too far. So where's the extra one? Where is the extra one? <laughs> just, just typical. Um, no, I can't, can I? I've got, I've got to find the last one. Damn you! <laughs> oh, oh. Slipped off then. Now, this is where I wish I'd done my uh, research because it has been a very long time since I've actually played this game and, and I can't remember which one I'm missing. Oh, I landed on that one. Oh, there we go. Gotcha. Jump over here. 
So where is it? Where is this last one? Did I go this way? I bet you I missed one right at the beginning. No, it's not that way. Is it the other way? We'll try the other way. And if I can't find it down here, I'm going to give up. No, it's definitely not down there. Didn't I already do this one? I'm sure I did this one, yeah. Oh, it's the top one. Damn, I just remembered, it's the top one. Because I have to go up the pipe. Oh, now I'm screwed. Can't get back up there. Oh. I'm going to call it there because I'm an idiot and I should have gone and got the other one. But that's cheese and onion. Uh, don't hate me that I didn't finish this level because uh, you're just going to see me die over and over again. If you want to follow up for where that final one was, I will do it in another video. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Play cheese and onion and give the Vic 20 a bit of love. See you again soon. Bye.